exercise 1.3 question number 11 if the sum of the first n terms of an ap is 4n minus n square here till in previous question they gave nth term general formula of nth term now they are given the general formula of sn sum of sum of first n terms of an ap is 4n minus n square what is the first term what is the sum of first two terms what is the sum of first two terms what is the second term similarly find third tenth and nth term they are asking now let me find so let us take the general formula they given sn equals 4n minus sn equals 4n minus n square so as i told you now let us substituting 1 2 3 in the place of n now now s1 let us find s1 4 into 1 minus 1 square in the place of n we are substituting 1 now 4 into 1 it is 4 minus 1 square 1 so 4 minus 1 it is 3 that means s1 is equal to 3 and remember s1 is nothing but a a1 because s1 means sum of terms s is sum of terms s1 means here sum of first term so first term for example if i take 1 3 5 what is the first term here 1 what is the sum of first one 1 clear so s1 is nothing but a1 so what is the first term of an ap here 3 again let me take 2 in the place of n here if i take 2 in the place of n 4 into 2 minus 2 square 4 2 is 8 8 minus 4 2 square means 4 so 8 minus 4 it is 4 now here we got s2 means sum of two numbers but we cannot take it as a2 first it is okay here s1 is equal to a1 there is no changes in this but when you are considering s2 it is not a2 please don't take like that because here s2 is nothing but sum of first two terms sum of first two terms so to get that just you have to subtract from s1 to get a2 s2 minus s1 so subtract these two that means 4 minus 3 4 minus 3 what is the s2 minus s1 to get a2 so 4 minus 3 is equal to 1 4 minus 3 is equal to 1 clear again substitute 3 in the place of n again 4 3 into 3 minus 3 square 4 3 is a 12 12 minus 3 square is 9 12 minus 9 it is 3 again 3 we got so again here to find a3 to find a3 this is a3 make it a3 so what to find a3 what we have to find s3 minus s2 previous one yes if it is a3 s3 minus s1 s2 sorry s2 if i take previous 3 minus 4 3 minus 4 we got minus 1 so which is the value of a3 here so if i take it that in the ap form that is ap equals 3 1 minus 1 please listen in s1 the first itself s1 is nothing but a1 but s2 for example if i take 1 3 5 these are the terms here here 1 is the first term 1 is the first term because s1 is nothing but a a1 but if i take 4 here 4 how we will get 4 1 plus 3 correct but I want second term. So what I will do? 4 minus 1. Clear. Sum of this is 4 I am getting. But I want the second term. What is the first term you got? 1. So 3 here 4 minus 1 you will get the second term. In the same case let us take 1, 3, 4. Sorry 1, 3, 5 like this. So I want the value like this. For example 1 plus 3. 4 4 plus 5 9 so what is the value of the a3 here is 9 but here the sum of here sum of three terms if i consider it is 9 but i want the value of a3 so what i will do 9 minus 4 the remaining the first two s2 so s3 minus s2 so 9 minus 4 you will get 5 which is the third term in the same case we are following here so first s1 itself a1 to get s2 subtract a2 my s2 minus s1 that means or you will first substitute 2 in the place of n you will get s2 subtract s1 you will get a2 again substitute 3 in the value of s3 and again you subtract from the previous s3 minus s2 you will get a3 
in the same way a4 how we will find first a4 what will be the using here a4 minus a3 again you will get a4 so if i keep on saying a1 a2 a3 if i take it as an ap so 3 comma 1 comma minus 1 if i take what is the value of a is 3 first term what is the value of d that means we have to subtract a2 minus a1 that is 1 minus 3 1 much we are getting minus 2 so minus 2 now what we have to find third term and tenth term and nth term correct third term third term is here we got third term is minus 1 a3 equals minus 1 changes to 3 so a3 equals minus 1 we got so what is the next one they are asking to find the tenth term that is a10 a10 can be written as a plus 9d because n minus 1 or 10 minus 1 now let us substitute a and d value a is 3 plus 9 into minus 2 again plus into minus minus 3 minus 9 to 18 3 minus 18 equals minus 15 so we got 10th term also what is the final one nth term nth term is just we have to find a n general formula so let us me substitute a n equals a plus n minus 1 into d a n keep it as it is 3 plus here value of a is 3 n minus 1 keep it as d is 2 if i substitute what happens 3 plus now if i multiply 2 this side 2 into n 2n minus into minus plus 2 ones are 2 so 3 plus 2 it is 5 so what will be the answer here minus 3n minus 2n plus here finally 3 minus so so 3 here if i multiply 2 into n 2n minus into minus plus now 3 plus 2 it is 5 minus 2n is the answer 5 plus 2n is the answer